Hey guys, welcome back. It's me, Esme. I know it's been a minute since I posted. It's just with everything going around, I didn't know what to post or I haven't had any good ideas. So we're just going to do an old-fashioned unboxing from BoxyCharm. And I did do a full face of BoxyCharm, as you can see. So if you want to see how I got this look and what I got in my BoxyCharm, please stay tuned. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. So, for those who don't know, BoxyCharm is a $21 monthly subscription box. You get five full-size products. And this BoxyCharm looks pretty big, so let's see what we have inside. And then after we open the box, I'm going to do a full face of first impressions of everything in the box. So, that's why I'm not wearing any makeup. And let's go ahead and open the box. Alright, so, okay. Some of them are trying to come out box looks like and it looks probably a camping theme because that's more than everything that's camp related it has spa glamming sunbathing yoga and slumber and it shows you what everything is and how much it retails for so that's exciting so it's gonna be your cheat cheat all right so the first thing in here is some um, Morphe brushes, all right, and it's a four piece eye brush collection. And this is retailed for four dollars. And I love getting brushes in my boxy charm because brushes are expensive. And then when I get them in my boxy charm, just like yes, let's go ahead and open it up. I love Morphe brushes, they look really good. Okay. We have a fluffy brush, a crease brush, and an eyeliner brush, and then a flat brush one, which is amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and put those with my other Morphe slash small brushes. Mix that in there. Alright, next thing in here is from Glam Glow. It's a moisturizer trip or or Omega Rich Moisturizer. And it's the green one. It's really pretty. And I love Glam Glow, even though like they're super expensive, but like their products are really good. And this is retail for $54. This is a hot lightweight anti redness moisturizer with OG omega rich cannabis seed oil that helps calm and ir irritate not irritate um, relieve redness and oh okay so this is mixed with cannabis oil i really like it so far then it's concealed oh it doesn't have like a strong scent it just smells really clean I'm excited to try this. Ooh. And this is applied directly to the clean skin and neck morning or night as part of your usual skin recommendation routine. So I'm excited for this. Alright, and since I'm filming this, this is the wrong one, so I guess I can put it on before I put primer on. Next thing in here is a Milk makeup fiber brush gel, and this is retail for twenty dollars. I love milk makeup anyway, so it's amazing. And the color grind, so it's like a dark brown. Kind of looks black in the camera, but it's dark brown. To try that out. All right, next thing in here is from what brand is this? Elizabeth Mont, and this is a Thank Me Later eye primer. So this is retail for twenty dollars. It's cruelty free, enhance your eyeshadow protection your makeup all day. Apply in the morning and go all night long without worrying about dryness quickness and transparent repair prepping your eyelids for a smooth and 
Even your application for your eyeshadow. Okay, so I love eye primer. So far, my favorite ones is probably the the Bond Cosmetics eyelid one, and then the Ulta Beauty eye primer because I did try the uh, Morphe one. I didn't like that one at all. And then I think that's it. So hopefully this one will work. But we'll see. Okay. Actually, I want to see what the point looks like. Cause the package is cute. It has little eyes on it. Okay. Okay, it looks like this. Okay. Alright, and the last thing in here is a Butter London Teddy Boy 9 piece eyeshadow palette. Okay, and this retails for $28. Okay, and then here's the back of it. Try on neutral. Has anybody seen that new Jiffy Star new collection? He's coming out with the Orgy palette. I actually want to get it. So I think it's pretty because like he always does wild colors, but like this is like a nude collection. And I'm like, I'm gonna get it. Because I already got the shooting one already. Because I've been late. And I still need his, um, his cremation one. So I'm a little bit behind of his cosmetics. But here is the Butter London one. I mean, it's not an interesting store. It's just more sleek cold tones. But we are gonna use this for the eyes. So, cute palette. Let me see how much all this is retailed for. This whole box. Because I only paid $25. And this alone was worth it. Because I love cannabis products. And then milk makeup. And then the eye shadow brushes. And then hopefully if this works, this will be probably worth it too. So, I mean, this box is really good. Just the one thing I didn't like was this. Alright, so let me total this up real quick. Alright, so this whole box retails for $134. I mean, that's really good for just paying $25 a month, which is really good. So let me put that to the side, and let's get started with this makeup look. So right ahead, I'm going to use this moisturizer real quick. And grab a clean brush and rub it around. Okay, actually, I can just grab some on here. Grab this brush. Grab some on my hair and just rub it all over. And it just feels like a normal moisturizer. So I will try to use this more this week and see if I see any results. Because lately I've been using the... I've been using this and this stuff has been cleaning my skin. And the... It's another moisturizer I've been using. <sighs> Some other one that I saw on TikTok. I've been using that too every night when I get off from work. And it's been clearing out my skin, so I mean, it's pretty good. Okay. And there's no strong scent, like I said, it smells really clean, so that's always good to hear. Alright, next thing is the primer. I'm going to use the one I got in my boxy charm for the eyelids and my nose, because I like to use. I lip primer for my nose because I have a really oily skin so my nose gets oily especially my eyelids so I'm going to use this and I'm going to mix it in and do my wait my elf putty primer for my face so I'm going to use my uh, when well flat brush the really long one and I should do need to get another one because this one's old as you can see it's like ripping apart but I'm probably gonna do that later today because I'm off so that's why I'm filming this video so let's go ahead and put 
And off the back, this kind of looks like the Elf primer because it's a light pink construction. Really. And it feels lightweight like a primer should. Cover the nose. Get some more and put it over the eyelids. Ooh, this looks really good. Of everyone been? Is everyone been that safe quarantine? Like, what is everybody up to? And I still need to film my Fluttershy collection because I did order another bag because they did release a new Nightmare Before Christmas collection. So I snagged one bag and one wallet because whenever I like to buy bags, I like to make sure I get the wallet with it because if not, it will like irritate me. And I do need to get another black set, but. I've been procrastinating. So while that sits, I'm gonna go ahead and use my primer, my face primer, and just grab some with the same brush on the face. Cause after I do my makeup for this video, I'm just gonna stay home, relax, drink some wine, cause I got some new. Stellar Rose flavors for my job because I want to try this watermelon flavor one and a grapefruit one, so I'm gonna have some me time because it's Sunday. Because I'm filming this on Sunday, I'll probably upload this either on a Monday or on a Tuesday. Probably a Tuesday, I'll probably upload this on a Tuesday. And during this quarantine, what has everybody been buying online like? Because lately I've been seeing on TikTok that Sephora's been having a secret sale. So like if you go to Juicy Pities, you know how they have Sephora inside. You just go through the app and you search up Sephora and they have certain things for like $10 and under. So I was thinking about buying some stuff. I was like, maybe it's just a glitch in the system, but people are like buying stuff. I'm just like, no, if it charges you full price, like, oh, I'm sorry. So, I mean, I've been seeing that around. So, alright. I'm gonna do my foundation off camera. And I'm gonna be using the Anastasia foundation. So, I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. And I went ahead and do my foundation, concealer, and then I did some baking and a little bronzer too. So I'm going to go ahead and finish my baking. Go ahead and do the underside right here. here. So it's like nice and snatch. Okay. And my eyebrows look so good. I didn't even touch them yet because we're going to use that milk makeup brow gel yeah so let's dust up this powder up the black shirt and get into it because lately i've been using the elf one because it's like three dollars and it just does the job too and i did get the same thing well this one's a clear brow gel because i got it in a uh, value pack because i got the full size mascara and then one of these and the lip balm for like I want to say two dollars a lip that's the part because they had like a good deal so let's go ahead and use this and oh it's already brown so it's gonna like shape it so I'm gonna grab my little brush my cap on the mirror and shape it in so I already have like thick brows, so it's gonna make it look like a more natural brow, but I'm still gonna line it because like it'll bother me. So, ooh. Okay. It's really good. Ooh. 
I'm going to grab my Anastasia Y'all Homemade Brow Dip. Add my brush and quickly line the top brow. Let's get some of the product out. Put on my hand. We get shape it in. Okay. Okay, quick brown, and then a little brow brush in here, so I'm going to brush it out. Okay, we're gonna leave them like that. Put this on. And we're gonna move to the eyes. So we're gonna use the Butter London Eyeshadow Palette. My do Duo Smoky Look. And then uh, let me see what kind of lashes I should have done with this. I'm probably gonna go for these right here. Let's go ahead and get into this makeup look. Starting with the brushes I put in my kit. And here's another one. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and use the fluffy brush. It's right here, and we're gonna dip into. Let's see this shade right here. Simon. Okay. And test the water out. So much like on the brush. I'm gonna dip in it. Cause this looks like a natural transparent look so far with the shade especially I don't think you can barely see it just blending so well with my skin tone okay. let me try the other side just stop the excess and there's like a lot of fallout but I mean most palettes do that so I mean they can't I don't mind that But make sure you always just like take off the axis because it will mess up your makeup. So she worked with bold colors. I have learned from my mistake too many times. We're gonna go ahead and work this here. Okay, and then we're going to go with the darkest brown, which is Graham. Right here. Put a little brush in there. Tap off the axis. Deep in the corner, we're going to blend that in. Tap it in. Tap it two. Quickly. 
going to use the same brush we did for the first shade. And I hope blend that out. Let's see more that color. Look something like this. Ooh. Okay. Very nice smoky look. I'm gonna do the exact same thing on the other side, so I'm gonna help push this out, dip it in the color. Dust off the excess. Okay, and we're going with. I actually want to mix a little black in there, so with the flat one. We're going to dip in with the, the black shade. We're just going to put a little bit right here. Okay, and then we're going to cut, oh, it says, we're going to cut the crease. Okay, I'm going to grab my primer, so, and we're going to cut the crease off camera, so I'll be right back. Alright, so I did the cut crease, and I did go ahead and put the lighter shell shade on top of it, so we're going to go ahead and do my lashes and fake I'm going to do my, curl my lashes, put fake lashes on, mascara, and then take everything off for the final, final look. So, I'll be right back again. Alright, so here's the final look. The eyes are complete, the lashes are on, and my mascara. So, I mean, I think this was a really good box. I just don't like the cold tones in this palette, but out of all the four things I like out of this five only like four things out of the five items that I got in my box trying so this was pretty good so all I need is some highlighter and let me just put some on I'm gonna put the Bratman Brock Morphe collection real quick I'm going with Gaycation. So, um, yeah. Alright, and then I'm gonna do the lips. So, I'm gonna go in and apply with. I'm just going with. This room that I got in my box charm from a while back. So to color one. Mm. 
And we're going to mix a different color on top. We're going to mix the Ace Beauty blush palette. We're going to get the light shade, this one. Because I like to mix my um, colors, I like to mix it with blush or sometimes the eyeshadow palette. To give it a more different color, if that makes sense. I'm sure anybody else does this, but I like to do this. Mm. And so this lip combo doesn't add, go together, but I think it looks cute. So that is my look for today. If you like this video, please leave a like and subscribe. I will eventually post that blush high collection one day, hopefully for Halloween. And I will probably do another Halloween giveaway because I love Halloween. So please stay tuned for that. And bye, you guys.